Lorentz constants. So this is the transformed equation which we want to solve using Soucy technique. So we have to rewrite our uh, operators as well. So if you remember our operators, A was basically taken as W of X plus by root 2M D by DX. So that was our uh, W of X after writing P cap as minus I H plus D by DX. Right? And similarly, we had A dagger to be equal to W of X minus H cross upon root 2M D by DX. So that is what when we formed the uh, A dagger A, these two factors gave us that minus H cross squared upon 2M D squared by DX squared. And then, of course, uh, we had two more factors, which were W squared of X minus H cross upon root 2M W dash of X. So, this is, what, this is how it was looking. So, we wrote this whole thing as some V1 of X, so that this will have the form of a Hamiltonian. Okay, but now our Hamiltonian has only D squared by DY squared. So, we don't want this factor H cross by 2M. So, what we do is we redefine our operators. In this fashion, let us say a equal to w of y minus d by dy. So a dagger will be w of y. I'm sorry, this we will define as plus. So w of y minus d by dy. And if you are to form this uh, product a dagger a, so a dagger a will give you minus d squared by dy squared plus w squared of y minus w dash of y. So this we can now uh, see as the new operator and similarly a a dagger should give us minus d squared upon dy squared plus w squared of y plus w dash of y. Okay, now what we want is we want to call this as a Hamilton h1 and we will call this as the partner Hamilton h2. Now, if you want to express H1 and H2 in terms of the harmonic oscillator Hamiltonian, the harmonic oscillator Hamiltonian is basically minus d squared upon dy squared plus y squared. Right? This was the Hamilton. Now, you can immediately see that w squared of y we should choose as equal to y squared. That is w of y, the super potential to be chosen for harmonic oscillator should be simply y. Okay, so if we choose like that, then you can immediately see that uh, your H1 will become equal to H harmonic oscillator minus W dash of Y. W dash of Y will be 1 and H2 will be H harmonic oscillator plus 1. So H2 can be written in terms H1 as H1 plus so this is where uh, you know the two Hamiltonians, par, uh, you know, uh, partner Hamiltonians are only uh, related through a constant, and they don't. This constant does is not an you know it's not a function of uh, uh, x cap or p cap or like that. So this is what gives us the advantage of using Soucy technique to solve the harmonic oscillator easily.